hello guys and welcome back to my channel how are you all doing today today's video is going to be a very interesting one i want to show you what me and my family eat during the summer months we are nigerians we live in the state of california and during summer it can get really really very hot and i make sure that everything we eat is according to how warm or how hot the weather is make sure you watch this video to the end because it's going to be very very interesting so yeah today's menu is going to be pretty simple and interesting i already have everything almost fully pre-cooked or cooked here i have a bowl of obono and a bowl of beans these have been in the freezer i brought them out last night to defrost them and this morning we're going to be having beans and akamu for breakfast but before we get into the main breakfast I like to give my kids some fruits because sometimes they get very cranky and impatient when I am making the breakfast. So I like to just, you know, give them some blueberry, oranges, bananas, strawberry, you know, any fruits that we have available in the house. And while they are, you know, eating that, I can concentrate and make the breakfast that we are going to be eating today. So like I said, I already have everything already cooked. I'm just going to heat up the beans in the microwave and then I'll go ahead and make the akamu. By the way, another name for akamu is pap. I think that's the English name, but I just love to call it akamu. It's easier for me. It's what I'm used to. Yeah, so akamu or pap is made out of corn. So, and this is American corn. It's very, very light. So it's going to be very easy for me to make. It does not get any lumps or anything like that. I have some Nigerian akamu in the freezer that my mom brought for me, uh, but I keep them for special, special locations. <laughs> so today I'm going to be using this one because it's very easy for me to make and gives me no trouble at all. You can also use moi moi or akara to eat our akamu, or sometimes I can just make oatmeal. You know, it depends on what my kids want or what I have available on the menu. But for today and for this video, I'm just going to be using beans because it's been a while since we had beans. And the way I love to make my akamu, I love to add a little bit of milk and some brown sugar. Brown sugar is what we eat. So breakfast is ready, our beans and akamu is ready. I am going to be feeding uh, Sophia. Aaron can absolutely feed himself. I love meal time. I love it especially because like we get to sit down together as a family on the dining and you know we get to chat, we get to you know laugh and usually there's music in the background. My kids love music. So some music is playing and you know we can sing along and you know nod our head. It's just a very happy and fun time for me because it's a way of bonding with my kids. So for me, my breakfast is usually very simple, very very simple. I'm going to be having a cold apple and some bread and tea for my breakfast. I already put this apple in the fridge last night, so this morning is very very cold. Uh, it's just my thing, it's kind of part of my breakfast routine or breakfast regimen. Yeah, and this is whole wheat bread. This is what I've been eating for the past three years now. It's very very good, very delicious. White bread always makes me break out and also makes me add gain weight. So yeah, stay away from eating white bread. So I'm eating some whole wheat bread or brown bread and some green tea. I'm not going to be adding sugar or honey or anything sweet. It's just going to be plain. So this is whole wheat bread. This is what I'm going to be eating. My breakfast is very simple and boring and dry, as dry as dryness can be. I'm having two slices of bread for breakfast and green tea, just one bag of green tea. I'm trying to lose weight. I'm trying to stay healthy. I'm not really trying to lose weight. I'm trying to stay healthy 
because I don't work out I don't go out and sweat in the sun and I feel like just eating a lot of stuff into my body and not burning it out is bad Aaron, are you hungry? Yes What do you want for lunch? I want yogurt Want yogurt? Yes Which yogurt? Peach yogurt Want peach yogurt? Yes Alright, open the fridge, let's get us some yogurt Which one do you want? They are so tall now, you can just reach in Look at this, is peach <laughs> This is the pitch. Look at it, pitch. All right. And Sophie is gonna have some blue, some blueberry yogurt. Okay. Our lunch is usually very, very simple, as you can see. This is something that we eat almost every day because it's so hot and by this time in the afternoon it's usually like 98 degrees you know in the very high 90s sometimes it can get up to a hundred over a hundred so i feel like giving my kids you know cold yogurt is just perfect and my son loves this greek yogurt so so much he has always loved it from when he was a baby so yeah and this thing oh my god i don't know the charm i don't know what they put in this thing it makes them sleep it sends it sends them to bed like right after they eat it and this is what my daughter is also going to be having this is like baby yogurt So while my kids are sleeping, I get some time to prepare my lunch. My lunch is usually like a very big production. <laughs> so I'm going to be having salad. I told you I am on a strict diet and also it is very, very hot. And when it is hot, the last thing I want to do is eat he any heavy food, you know, like rice and all that stuff. So for lunch, I'm going to be eating very, something very light salad and i like to make my salad you know like this this bag of salad you know usually the way it is sold in the store it's already like or they already put all the vegetables together and it comes with some dried cranberry and some uh sunflower seeds and also some pomegranate uh dressing this is a pomegranate dressing this is what i'm gonna be using to make my salad today i also have other stuff you know to just dress it and you know just make it really really nice i have a bag of almonds and walnuts and everything nice everything that can make my salad crunchy is what i have in this bag right now and it's sold like that in the store i'm also going to be adding some um cucumber some people like to have their cucumbers with the back or with the skin on it i like to take off the skin completely and just chop it you know into tiny bits and add in my salad i'm also going to add some avocado i'm also going to add some tuna fish i mean this is really like you know the the main food of the day because you see my breakfast was very very dry so i try to you know um make it up during lunch time so here is my lunch for the day i'm also going to add some grapes you know just this is just my own way of making salad sometimes i like to add sweet corn uh gabaganzo beans all that plenty of stuff but today i'm keeping it light and simple if you love my salad please let me know in the comment section <laughs> maybe i will do a tutorial just showing you how to make simple salad simple yummy salad by yourself at home restaurant quality so this is the tuna fish this is white abacore tuna fish uh, it's actually in water there's water in the can and i'm gonna open it and 
add it to my salad you know at least let me give myself some protein and it's just been very very dry yeah so let me add some fish in my salad bowl this it's a very cold bottle of chilled water because it is so damn hot this is gonna give my body you know some life come and join me oh, I have not invited anybody to join me all this time I'll be eating oh my god <laughs> please come and join me this bowl of salad is so yummy I don't even know what I'm saying anymore So for dinner, I'm going to change the game a little bit, I'm going to make it a little more interesting. We're going to be having amala and obono soup for dinner. I think it's ideal to end the day with some swallow. What do you think? <laughs> I know my kids are going to be very, very happy and excited because they love it when we are eating eba or, you know, pounded yam, amala, anything swallow, especially with obono soup or okra soup. They love it, they enjoy it. And I know you have not seen no son, my husband, you know, in this video. Yes, he's at work this morning, but he will also not be joining us this evening because my husband takes his time to work out a lot at the gym. So he's not really a fan of heavy foods. He loves my food. He eats when he wants to, but for today, he will not be eating with us. Here is my amala and obono soup looking all nice and beautiful and ready to be destroyed into say, our toilet. Say, oh Lord, bless oh, this Lord. food for Christ's sake. Amen. 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 Good job, Aaron. Can you close your eyes? So this video is almost coming to an end. I just wanted to add this funny clip where my son is, you know, trying to use his spoon to eat his amala. He never likes to use his hand, you know, to eat a bar or any of this food. So I allowed him to use a spoon on camera and, you know, I got to give him a round of applause because he's doing really well. Anyway, this is what we eat on summer days. I hope you have enjoyed watching this video. You can leave your comments for me in the comment section. Thank you for watching and I will see you in my next one. Bye. Let me go ahead and enjoy my amala.